All right, guys, and welcome back to Acrylic. Um, as I said off screen, I was going through this fucking darkness, and I acquired a tripod and a pencil somehow, <laughs> and I found this. So, yes, we will go into this brightly lit room. <laughs> Finally, a place with a little bit of light. Yeah, it definitely makes me feel a lot better. Mm -hmm. Although, what is it? Well, where is that light coming from? You're right. I'm not sure. I guess we'll take a look around and see what we can figure out. Look at this. <laughs> Everything's in a, a negative except for this trash can. <laughs> it's kind of cool though. Um, so yeah. I like... Uh, psh, okay, just walk over this. I am digging the art style. But uh, let's see what we can find. Uh, some more markers. Doesn't appear to be go... It doesn't appear to be much going on in this room. Please tell me there's like something I can get. Huh? Something wedged in the cushion. Digital camera. Alright, well let's just clear out these other chairs. Although I doubt it, but you never know. So is this turning into Fatal Frame now? Alright, all the chairs are cleared. Now. Dead flashlight. Uh, it appears to have something jammed inside. Okay. Hmm. This sucks. Alright, well we'll save here. Maybe if we try to leave. The door is locked. Nicole, please tell me that you're kidding. Hello. Who, who are you? Oh no. Oh no. I'm so tired of this shit. What? <laughs> My best friend's keeping me from... Oh. Just as Nicole hears the click and snap of the camera shutter, she sees an immense white flash... White? Wait. Flash of white light. Much bigger than, the no than normally used. That's still too... It's too bright. More sounds ring out in an echoed manner in the dark development room, and they sound harsh and grating to Nicole's ears. Okay, that's enough photos now. As this shuddering words leave Nicole's hoarse throat, she begins to feel an overwhelming sense of fatigue. Her energy is dwindling, though as hard as she tries, she can't come up with an explanation. She's dying, isn't she? The mysterious girl continues to take pictures with a blinding light, causing Nicole's eyes to feel hot and tear up. With each flash and click of the camera, she feels her strength growing weaker. Despite her pleas for her to stop, as if, as if the innate artist within her can't bring herself to the camera. It put the camera down. Snap, snap, snap. Weak, weak, weaker. Nicole falls to her knees, unable to keep her eyes open any longer. Her conscience is fading as if... As if the camera itself is drawing her soul out. That is a myth. The cameras do steal your soul. It's really awkward for her to be dancing around us as we're dying. Oh, that's different. She's spelling help with the paintbrush. Okay, what the fuck am I supposed to do here? I'm supposed to run, I think. Alright, what am I supposed to do now? <laughs> now that I escaped her. Kind of. No matter what? The door won't budge. Okay. What am I supposed to do? Hmm. You can't use items in this game, so... Don't kill me, please. Uh, take the pointer. Leave it to me. I could pry the door open with this. Okay, cool. Come over here and... Oh, nope. There we go. Ghosty. 
Just a little more. Great, we escaped. From that shit. And back into the darkness we go. It's actually, for some reason, it's a little brighter. Kind of. For me, I don't know how. So, don't go back in there, right? Oh no, now it's back to darkness. Yeah, I can kind of see now. A little bit. Yeah, I don't like it. I don't like this darkness. Uh-huh. This one's open. Oh, it's a fucking rat. Etch and sketch, is that you guys? Etch and sketch. Oh. Uh, she feels their soft, fluffy bodies move around her bare legs. What are you guys doing? <laughs> Suddenly, without notice, Nicole feels two small bites pierce her skin. Great. She feels temporary relief as a small creature releases her tight grip. However, just seconds later, they assault her again. And bit her arms and her chest over again. Hey, quit it, you guys. <laughs> Stop biting my chest. And I died. Good lord. How many times, like, I've been dying a lot to the white, uh, ghost. So I wonder... I died 30 times. But I need to, in order to get the best ending, I have to die 20 unique times. Which, I probably, it probably won't happen. I need to find a flashlight quick. But I'm glad it's a little brighter now. I don't know what was going on before. Where it's pitch darkness. Huh? Found another pencil in the darkness. I was gonna say this this right here. Whoa. This right here is making me appreciate some of those games where it's like it's dark but you can see everything and you can't examine things because it's too dark to see. You need a flashlight. Whereas this is just she can read everything she's looking at but you can't see unless you stumble upon it you know like she's able to read notes and shit in this darkness but I can't see a thing it's unbelievable but it's it's not that bad right now which is really weird why wasn't it like this before and yeah, every room kind of has like a music cue that happens, which kind of helps in pitch black darkness. It shows you you're in a new room. But uh, other than that, there's nothing going on. Not in this room. Messy stack of papers on the desk from the professor. What do you know? It looks like teacher's information to log in somewhere. Huh, okay, well, I know where to go for that. Alright, I still have my notebook and pen, uh, pencil. So, Robert... Robertson M, which... That computer is on the first floor. So, this is telling us to go there. Home R. Okay. I'll just log in that... I'll just log that away in case I get the urge to start hacking again. I fucking hate that it's this dark for everywhere. Alright, let's try a log in. They are case sensitive. Okay, so. Robert. <laughs> I feel like I messed that up somehow. Looking back at it. Alright, Robert M. Or Robertson M. And password is home room. Or home R. Don't get it twisted. Alright, what does this tell us about the ghost and the camera? Sick. It worked. Homer has a password, huh? I guess he must enjoy classic Greek poetry. Actually, I heard he is a huge fan of that cartoon uh, that's been on forever. Is a key. A key? Uh, not, uh, not quite what I expected, but I guess we can give it a try. Oh shit, where, where was the reference room at? 
I'm glad I got it, but where was the reference? Oh, you know what? You know what it'll tell me? Oh, shit. I can't see a fucking thing. Okay, wait. Hold on. This, this right here. Damn it. Alright, yeah, the reference room is on the first floor as I wanted to see, but I had to double check. Oh, God. Where are we? Oh, okay, we're on the bottom left there. Holy shit. Please be batteries. <laughs> I see a, I see notes there, but I don't want to pick it up yet. I want to, I want some batteries. Uh, sure, let's look up a student's name. Oh, I don't know. I don't even know the ghost's name. Ugh. I'm going to play this game again. Hmm. Uh, G through P. Q through Z. I'll have to look through that later, I guess. Oh, boy. I don't like playing this game in darkness. It's very hard to make out shit. As I've complained about over and over. Alright, what is it? Oh, on the desk small book at logging all the visitors and reference requested. Oh, thanks. So I'm in here for... to look for somebody, so... Uh, Alright, let's look up... Let's try to see if we can find out something. I gotta go through the whole list. Nicole Chapman. Huh. Hey, it's my own file. Senior... I love watercolor. Oops. Okay. Ooh, there are three students. So, Samantha George. Sophomore graphics design. I remember her. 20 pounds. What about the other ones? Sasha Gre Greherg? Freshman photography. That's probably her. So Sasha. That's just her... Whatever. Her description. Hmm. about Stephanie also photography so Stephanie and Sasha I colors green interesting okay one file for Chelsea uh, Whitney she loves drawing yeah that's what well, that is the person we met on this floor I'm hoping that something good will come out of all looking at some of these something. This is a really tedious way of, of looking through files rather than just like, hey, here are some names of interest. Who do you want to look at? This game does some weird things. All, a lot of unnecessary things. And that's it. So we've gotten nothing, really, from this reference room. Except the descriptions of, of us, which is kind of creepy. I mean, the school board needs to know this stuff, but it's like, then what? We got nothing of note here. We do know Stephanie and Sasha are in photography. That's about it. I guess it's back to the... Uh... May allow the user to reach a hired... Wait a minute. Maybe this is used to get something off the top of some shelf, which is on this floor, if I remember right. Oh, 
but with no flashlights is so bullshit. I remember it being somewhere around here. Something squished under here. Student ID card. Okay, so... Mail out access to a student area. So yeah, there is a room over here that says it needs an ID. Finally, something different. Is it this one? Oh, here we go. Go through this fucking room. Alright, let's play the game. Where? Which corner am I in? Or I'm in... What the hell? What the fuck? <laughs> Finally. Hello, can you hear me? Oh, hi. My name is Nicole. We would like to help you. Looks like she has her hand out, like, asking for something. You probably want to know your name, don't you, miss? I have two guesses. She's talking to you, lady. Joelle, can I take your picture? Huh? You did before, and you fucking killed me. Not her. Just you. T Politely decline. I did save after I got the ID. Listen, miss, I have something, I have something much more important to tell you. You want to know your name, don't you? Name? Yes, your name. Who you are. Uh, it's either Sasha or Stephanie. I didn't write them down. Hopefully it's Sasha, because I don't really remember how to spell Stephanie. I might have to look at Facebook real quick. Is your name Sasha? No. Well, fuck. It's too bright. I guess your name is Stephanie. Just so I don't get the name wrong, I'm gonna look on Facebook real quick. <laughs> oh, cool. So I used the batteries. Okay, but let's save over here in case for some reason we can't escape. So now it's red. Interesting. And yeah, I just accidentally interacted with her. Oh, thank God we have some light now. God. Huh? No, don't take my picture, please. Alright, so. Uh, Stephanie is... Steph... And that isn't... Exactly matches. Stephanie? Yeah, that's your name. You're Stephanie Craig. Greg. A junior here at the academy. Do you remember? She doesn't want to remember. You poor thing, Stephanie. Stephanie, I know this is difficult, but I have something to ask you. Now that you know your name, do you remember anything about what happened to you? Yes. Do you mind telling us? I will try. Thank you, Stephanie. I was here late one night. It was the night just like this one, actually. I was finishing up some work on my recent photo portfolio. I thought I was alone. But someone else was here with me. I recall being quite surprised, as staff usually wasn't here so late, especially professors and the dean and such. A man, he... Go on, Stephanie, we're listening. A man came up from behind me. He surprised me, and he... Leave me alone. I don't want to talk about this anymore. Stephanie, we want to help. I won't say it again. Leave me alone. Nicole, let's go. <laughs> oh, okay. Thank you, Lord. Woo! All right. Spent a lot of time on this episode, so I'm going to stop here. Hope you guys are enjoying, and I will see you next time as we explore this place more thoroughly.
And I'll look for that area where I need the... I think the tripod is going to knock something off the top of that shelf, whatever room that was again. But anyway, I hope you guys are having a great day, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.